We're gonna open some amiibo all the live long day. Yeah. Um, so welcome everyone. We're gonna open up some amiibo because I've got a crack ton that need to be opened. In case you're wondering, I just got the Samus and Metroid amiibo today. And then I realized I haven't opened these or these ones. So let's get cracking, yeah? Okay. Okay. Oh, you want me to help you? Yeah, hold the phone. You could have told me that before you started recording. There we go. All there right. you go. Wife First helping. Off, we're going to start off with Cloud. And then work our way across. Maybe. So, let's go. Oh, what's this? I don't know. Am I supposed to make a reaction? <gasps> That's not how we roll. Oh, yeah. Almost done. Here we go. Da -da -da -da. Yeah, look at that Buster Sword. I think this one looks pretty cool. Sword feels good. Nice. Very, very nice. Not much to say about it, to be honest. Not too much detail going on there. A little simplistic. I think the Advent Children one looks cooler, so we'll get to that eventually. Next up is Bayonetta in her Bayonetta 2 costume. I've got two of these, by the way, so let's just rip it open. Yes, you made a mistake. You can never have enough Bayonetta, though, so that's okay. Sexy witch, yeah. She's a witch? She's a witch. Dumb wife doesn't know anything in the background. Hair feels like plastic, as expected, I guess. Kind of like a leathery feel, though, to it, which I guess makes some sense, maybe? Anyways, Bayonetta. Alright, we're gonna skip the Metroid 2 pack for now and Why? save that for last. I wanna squish it. We're gonna save it for last. Okay. And I can't get it out. There we go. Cloud Amigo. I like his name. There we go. Advent Children. I think this one looks really cool. The shoes are pretty shiny, along with the little mate feel of his trench coat here, whatever you call it, I guess. And all the buckles and belts you'd expect. Is it really a trench coat? It looks like it's wrapped around his waist. It's not really. It's just <laughs> it's Tetsuya Nomura. Look don't know at what my to say about arm, one arm muscle. That's Tetsuya Nomura for you. And there we go. Now we're going to go on to a Bayonetta Player 2 model, which is technically Bayonetta's first model because this was the first game and this was the second game. So this should be Player 2 and this should be Player 1. But hey, what do I know? And I realize that's how it is in the game, but it still doesn't make sense. Flinging up all these ribbons and her hair about. Yeah. I like how Bayonetta is just, she's so tall, but they have to get her to amiibo height. And of course, she's a flexible lady, so I mean, they have no issue with that. But her feet have to stand wide to support her base. That's kind of funny. <laughs> Fly me to the moon, baby. Well, then. That's the name of the song. 
Oh, I don't know. They plane I don't play any of these games, I'm sorry. They plane fly me to the moon. Buy mm. some Mario Odyssey Amiibos and I'll be totally down for that. Okay, open it. Metroid Amiibos that I don't have the game for, but you know, I had to buy them. I mean, you bought Breath of the Wild on the Switch like months before we had a Switch, so. Classic meal pose. This one looks a lot more shinier than the other one that we have, and also a lot more bigger, though. I mean, because she's squatting down, but if I had the Samus model with me for Smash Brothers, I think we would see there's some differences for sure. More detail for one, and second off, the material looks a lot better. So cool. When you said shiny, I really wanted to sing shiny for shiny. Moana. <laughs> The best one for last. The little Metroid that could be. Like the little engine that could? Oh, wow. can I can I can I poke it? I wanna poke it. Ah that's fun. I like that one. <laughs> I never played that game though. Glass has some nice feel and texture to it, yeah. Broken up little ground. I would like when they do more with the base than just Normal a plane. base. Yeah. You get something more to it. Makes it feel more like they captured the moment. Look at his little cute teeth and his little claws and his little, little brain cells. I don't know what you call those things. <laughs> his little, little brain cells? Mm, yeah, it's so cute, except they murder you. Oh, but, well. You know. Minor details. All right. Let me go ahead. All right. Get a close up. You're welcome. Thank you. So here we go. Each and every one of them. Oh no, TV glare. Stop. Stop your madness. Here, let's get a... Switch your angle. Out of the... Yeah. There we go. Focus on that cloud. Whoa. That looks cool. More Bayonetta. Some close-up of Bayonetta. No, don't focus on the Yoshi in the background. Focus on Bayonetta. Mm, but Yoshi. Yeah. Remember, you only have 10 minutes. I know. I'm trying to fill up the 10 minutes on this here timer. And the cloud. Advent Children Cloud. Sorry for that random flicker. I hit my phone. And last but not least of the Smash series, Bayonetta Player 2 model. Yep. Samus Aran, as I like to call it though, Aaron, but hey, I don't know what I'm talking about because the game says Aran or something, I think, I forget now. This one's cool though, some nice detail. Look at that. And the Metroid, hatchly, fresh out of its test tube. And we're almost out of time, but hey, thanks again, everyone. Hope you enjoyed. I'm going to poke it one more time. Poke. All right. Thanks for watching, everybody. Hope you enjoyed. Please leave a comment, like, and subscribe. Or, well, I guess if you want. I don't care. <laughs> <laughs> thanks, everyone. Bye-bye.